All right, it's time for a play City Skylines. I'm gonna turn on the sim in our expansive metropolis. All right, so we were just starting to build out up this way um, when I uh, last stopped playing. Mostly, I just wanted to make sure we had this stop that goes out that way. Um, so what I think I wanna do is build up to the edge of this square here and um, uh, realistically, uh, this, uh, so I, I think, you know, it's fine to have, like, all the subway stops we have here, as long as, basically, it's running an express once it gets out here. Um, I, I think that, uh, we're gonna try and maintain a kind of hierarchy that I, I've somewhat confused when it comes with, because I didn't know about it at the time. With the way that my trains are running, I may end up switching the trains up a little bit and just having basically subway go between these different neighborhoods. <clears throat> maybe not Johnson Glen, maybe Johnson Glen is far enough that it it warrants train. But maybe what I'll end up doing is like, maybe the train from here stops not here, but here, you know, something like that. I'm not sure. I have to review what my trains are actually doing. I'm not going to worry about that right now. I'm going to worry about this area. So first of all, let's make a district. To make sure these folks can get um, access. Well, first things first. Let's bring this down. This a little lower if we can. All right. And actually, before I do anything here, uh, I, I've been talking about these with the customer thing and that it can sometimes just be like not enough industry or something like that. Um, like this place. They sell furniture. <laughs> um, let me go into this here. Um, Yeah, so we have a deficit of petrochemicals. We have a huge deficit of convenience food. So maybe we can try and fix some of those. But I thought there was a way that we could enable um, having these come in, like, um, the same way that you can decide whether or not you're going to import electricity and stuff like that. Um, see if I can find it. Um, would that just be an options? Let me see. All right. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, oh, let me see something here. Okay. Um, and we've got move it. Um, I thought that there was somewhere where you can, you can, um, tell it, um, whether or not you're allowed to import stuff. I thought I saw City Planner plays muck about with something like that in order to, um, subsidies, service upkeep, service trade. Yeah. Hmm. I could have sworn. I could have sworn there was something where you can you can say, hey, we're gonna allow maybe if I click on these specifically. Cause you know, before you would import whatever you didn't have. I think that's why I'm getting this issue. Alright, so I'm gonna say if there's a way to do it, I don't know how. Um so, materials were mostly fine. Material goods, however, so petrochemicals, this means what? How, how do I, how do I interpret this? <laughs> that we're importing it? That we don't have enough? Is that, is that how I am, how I, um, because we have import and export on there. Alright, convenience food. Okay.
Yeah, I wish I understood how to read this. Alright, maybe it means we need to mine more petrochemicals. Let's see. So here we're drilling. We make crude oil here. Let me go back into here. Alright, I think this is just saying we need more agriculture. I think. Let's see. Let's see. So we are at 30... 8.7. I gotta write this down somewhere. Got my pen. Need a piece of paper. Alright, so... So, ag. We've got a 38.7 deficit. Um, or grain. Uh, grain. And veggies. All right, so let's see, let's see, let's see <coughs> if I were to go to, so this is something we haven't done in a while. Um, oh, let me make sure I don't have one of these hanging out ready to be placed. Oh, we do. We have the oil refinery. I will get back to that later. <laughs> um... Okay, so if we say grain, it needs fertile land. There's some fertile land here, some fertile land here, some fertile land there. Some fertile land over here. All right, let's see what makes sense. So realistically, what is this off of Barlow Way? All right. Let me get out of this mode so I can orient myself to what's going on here. Ah, okay, I see where this is. Okay, so I think we're going to want this tile here. Not that one. All right, and let's go back to where we can see... Okay, so basically... All of this here should be farmland of some sort. Um, so what I think I'll do is I will have... I'm gonna have this road come off here. Then we're gonna have a gravel road come out this way. And we're going to place one little house for the, for the people that live here, work here, whatever. And then we're going to go here, grain farming. I'm gonna put that guy right there. Even though it's slightly less efficient, I'm going to set it up as um, a series of farms, not just one. Uh, I say less efficient because it's gonna, you know, we're gonna take up the uh, we're gonna take up more land for like the the building. Let's see, I'm gonna give it more of a, more of a square plot. Here we go. All right, so that's there. Um, and I think uh, something I've seen some YouTubers do that I like is, so there's kind of like this fence here but I like putting like a row of trees in between. I really like the aesthetic when other YouTubers do that. And that's what I'm gonna do. We'll do that. And since it's meant to be a fence, we'll do fence mode. Just 
go out. That. Oops. Let's go to single point mode for a minute. There we go. Bruce. All right. Um, so we'll grab another one, put them right here. I know it's not super realistic to have the um, perfectly square plots, but something about it really calls to me. Alright, so we've got these two here. right here for these guys. Has anyone seen my keys? My keys! What? We're on the air? I guess this is meant to be their house, but that's okay. Uh, sorry about that. It's uh, nothing important. I just lost my keys. I'm sure they'll turn up. They're for the brown... So if I were to look... Uh, Probably shouldn't have said that if anyone finds them. Please... Here. Oh, don't steal my car. I mean... The old Rain, we now have a 36.1 ton per month. Okay. Here they are. Well, so, never mind. here we go. <laughs> Thank you for listening to uh, Second Moon. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Glenda. But apparently, that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So, a housing shortage is bad. We'll kind of go off like that. Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within ideological reward structures, which are entirely apart from the actual rewards enjoyed. For example, consider capital. One, right, one final question, Professor. Is the housing shortage going to make me richer? By certain metrics, perhaps yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its effect on the human Thank you, right. Professor. It is a question of priorities. Um. Interesting news from the city's export division. Sources tell us that our city has more services than we know what to do with. Oh. And you Wait, know what? what? That means, folks. It means we're there we not go. cutting things close nope. enough. Well, no. The point is we're selling it and bringing money into local economy. That's right. Economy. You could almost say it's too much of a good thing. Or we could say that we're enjoying a positive trade balance and the economy is booming. More after this. Sometimes I feel like uh, Professor Nutbutter and this lady are just being a little too real with their, their arguments. Hmm. Okay, cool. So we've got a slightly larger area there. Oh, longer at any rate. Good fences make good neighbors, they say. Maybe, and watch, for all the freaking gas stations we have, it doesn't spawn a gas station, but there could maybe be like a little gas station right there. Let's grab another one. 
Oh, let's do some vegetable farming since we need veggies too. Got a dairy house. Look at that. Grab the dairy house now. That's a weird bug. Nice. Vegetables and livestock. <laughs> Almost meat. I like it. Alright, let's get... Let's see. So in terms of our... Production needs... Alright, these are dropping, which is good. Alright. Well, let's just finish out this area here. go. Some more livestock here. And let this one take up this whole area. There we go. I was like, where do I need to connect? I just want this to be done. Excuse me, Rachel Keaton, you're making it hard for me to see what I'm doing here. Okay. Very good. I wonder why we haven't had any animals or anything plop on here. Maybe we don't. I don't know. I haven't made that much industry to where I would know. Yep, there we go. There's our secondary building here. I guess this one's actually big enough. Hey, we got cows. Yeah, pretty good animation on the cows. Good quadruped animation there. Alright. Let those keep developing. 
We'll do some... Doo -doo 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 -doo. Let's see. Alright, I'm just going to... Go over... Down... I'm going to say that this weird lot just has to do with the fact that, you know, this is before um, the place got urbanized, so I'm going to have strange lots, potentially. Alright, I will put a big green one here and a, another big dairy up there, I think. And that'll be it for now. Then we'll take a look and see, like... Oh, vegetable, I guess I should do, really. Veggies. Um, we'll see, like, hey, did this actually... ...clear out some of those commercial issues? Alright. So this is... Grain. This is livestock. Livestock. And we needed veggies. good. What did this one get? A greenhouse. Alright. So, if there's any difference, I don't notice it, but it may just be that we are still quite short of what we need for that. Back to what I was going to do up here. I really not have a birdsong acres anywhere? I feel like I've seen that before. Bedford acres, Bedford garden. Alright. Good a name as any. Let's get our L train. <coughs> Just to get the track out of the way. Really? There you go. I was like, I don't know what madness you're proposing here, but I am not here for it. All right. Oh, it's... Where was it? It's Thick Digital. We always see the commercials for it. In fact, let's switch over to that radio station. All right. Um... Do, 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 do. Actually, let's bring this line all the way to the edge. I can see what happens with this street here. Uh, which... Do, 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 it is a... Four-way divided. Cannot write a perfect 90. What I'm gonna do is let's go. Go complex maybe? No, continuous, continuous. Go up, over. Alright, that was a fail.
good enough. All right. We need some city services here in Birdsong Acres. do a regular size medical clinic because it's going to be a high density neighborhood. And we're also going to get a small police station. I think right here next to the police could definitely have some offices. There's like a pharmacy or something here next to the um, medical clinic. All right, we're going to place a underground parking. another block all right we're gonna throw education in here i think this will be like a little education campus area um let's do some high density housing here housing all right so all that does its thing let's add some schools here 
All right, this is gonna be a pretty, oh, we're gonna go with urban, that's right, because this is an urban area. So we're gonna go with urban elementary and urban high. I'm gonna say right away, you are locked to here and you are locked to here. Bird song acres. That's definitely how you spell that. There we go. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, water, are we okay water wise? Uh, we're on the cusp. So, let's see here. All right, these are being overloaded and they'd be upgraded. That one's already been upgraded. That one's already been upgraded. Throw another guy right here. All right, See if we're good now. Yep, we're good. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, so we've got the underground parking here. Uh, we've got buildings going up all around. Uh, we've got our L train. Um, I think here I'm going to attempt to do what I did before where I had kind of, and it should be more easy to do now that we've got the um, smaller parking lots so this is going to go up like this and then this is going to be like an apartment complex essentially so we will have and then we'll have some motorcycle parking on the end here All right and then this is going to be for the apartments that are here and here here. Right, I don't know why you suddenly don't want to exist, but there you go. All right, cool, cool, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and give them the playground. Give them their sports thing. And this one's already almost full, so we're going to upgrade him. This one we're fine. Less young folks there at the moment. Still making a lot of money. Still growing. All right, cool. So there's our covered parking for these um, apartments. All right. So I would say that again here near the um you know what don't think i want street parking here uh, uh you know what i'm just gonna let it slide i'm not gonna worry about that just for now All right. however uh let's see so we connected down there um i think let's bring oak street up I think we would make a connection here. And probably put some more offices here, I think.
Right? For the best in men's clothing, Kolchache trades. We have all the finest silk and many other. Whatever you desire. All right, I'm going to finish out our um, grid for Birdsong Acres. Um, maybe pre-zone and add um, add bus routes. Although, let's see, where was I? Love the cheap and random flea market. We came here with the grandkids, and we'll stay cheap and random. Oh, sure, I've been. Right, we probably need another bus depot as well. In fact, I was here last Tuesday. Cheap and random. Toaster works fine if you flip the bread. Cheap and random. What is that thing? What is that Everybody thing? Everybody, get out of here! What is that thing? That is oh a frog nut extraction. Sheep and red. All right, you I think what you're gonna get, and you never will unless you come find out. So this does what? More trains. And this makes faster me. All right, let's do this. And then let's do this. Because I want to develop this area. All right, that's fine, because I did want to make a road back here anyway. So we're going to do that. So I want to put my bus depot here. I want to connect it to this road over there. Um, so let's see, let me do my connection. Actually, I'm going to bring this connection across. So, and then what I'll do actually, let me see how big this thing is. I don't remember. I know it's pretty huge. All right, we could, we could probably fit it back here. So I'm going to grab and... I'm gonna go like that. A steepo right there. This will be the eh, basically Bedford end. No, I'm gonna call it real yard. So I know it's near the rail yard. All right. So this will do its thing eventually. Um, that was a bad place to put it. Okay. Let's. All right. So, <laughs> whoopsie. Uh, so we will actually come out here like this. And we're going to have to move you. over here. Okay. I'm gonna get rid of this. I'm gonna get these lines connected here. So that's done. Hmm. Looks like these have to be one way. So 
but I think I'll just use the double tracks then, which I think will allow subway trains to queue up. I'm not entirely sure, but I think that's the way it works. All right, so I'm going to come to here and then start trying to curve in. Should give me room to go. Out. Don't know if that's enough room, but we'll see. That's not too much all at once, but we'll find out. All right, so now let's finish out this grid. This episode has gone a little bit longer than I wanted it to, but that's okay. Thing I do want to do is I want to put another college here. Then, in that case, I will do a pedestrian path, pedestrian street. There we go. All right, for now, I don't think I necessarily have to restrict who can go there. High school is just about completely full. I can't believe much demand there was for that. Alright, we'll take care of that after we finish things out here. So, 
Olive Street. Do another connection here. All right. So I think here, this is our college. Maybe we have some um, teacher housing here. Oops. Wrong. Oh, no one's moved in yet, so let's go. Through. school right here. city has overall dropped a bit in happiness. We'll have to... What is it? Unreliable mail service is the biggest reason. Okay. So we may need to visit that in the future, in a future episode. Alright, so I'm going to say here off of campus... We will have just an anticipatory... I have an elementary school right there. I say Bird Song Acres teaching elementary school. Alright, and I did not select the district yet, so I got full with some other people. There we go. Oh, somehow I didn't end up picking Birdsaw Anchors here. That's why I got full so fast. Now entering thick digital games. Prepare for sensory overload. You want it thick? Digital! Are you a man or a mountain? Digital! Are you ready for a game that rips out your heart and stops it to death? Digital! Then come on down to thick All right. We'll hook you up to adrenaline over Gonna have a little business right here. And we're going to have some row homes right here. Oops. I don't ask for Denny. Come on down to Denny's Denim's. I'll set you up. Don't ask for Denny. All right. We got this guy across the top here. All right. Let's connect here. I'm going to leave it like that, actually. All right. So now... And I grab some parking here. Oh no, there's parking right there. So let's see. But let me set up my parking throughout here. Let's have a medium lot. No, we need one. 
for the students, right? So we'll put one there. Uh, we'll have one there. I'll actually have one on every block here because we're going to have businesses and high density residential and offices. So here we go. I'm going to kind of ping pong back and forth here. Let's see. Put you there. Let's grab a um large plaza, which does not fit by just a little bit. We'll grab a small plaza. And put that right there. So this is going to be high density residential. That is not high density residential. There we go. All right. Um, on this side, let's do some row homes. That's done. So now let me just do my buses. We're just gonna do a loop in each direction that ends up here. good starting here clockwise. subway lines really quickly. So some getting decent utilization, some barely getting any riders, ridership. It's okay. We can work on that as we go along. Hmm, got some people waiting there, that's good. And 
back over here. Fairview Acres. Got some stuff there. Passengers going back. <laughs> There's a crime that had happened there, okay. Alright. Cool. Then let's if there's any cars driving out here by our farms, let's let's have our farm area be got a tractor. Don't think that's gonna be quite exciting enough. Garbage truck, eh? We'll follow the garbage truck out of our farm area. Actually, really quickly. Decisive there. Heading into uh, Barlow. We'll let them drive through Barlow a little bit and then that'll be the end of the episode. Going walking their dog here.